welcome to JS Network. Today we are going to see how to find or how to determine the sample size. We know what is sample and what is population in an analysis. When we take an organization and if we know that total number of employees in the organization, that's a population. And if it is not possible to go to all and get the response, what we will do, we will take a percentage of that population and collect the responses and that is a sample, sample size. So let us see the formula. The formula is Clovin's formula. And this is the case if the population is known. The formula is n is equal to n divided by 1 plus n e square. Small n is a sample size and that is equal to population size. That is capital N divided by 1 plus n into e square. E is the margin of error. Normally we are taking the margin of error as 2 percentage. So this is the case if the population is known to us. Okay. And next is the standard sample size formula. This formula is Coran's formula. And the formula is n is equal to z square pq divided by e square. Small n that is a sample size and that is equal to z square. z is a standard error associated with the chosen level of confidence. And if the level of confidence is 95 percentage, and that is what normally we are taking, level of confidence as 95 percentage, and then the typical value of Z will be 1.96. P is the variability or the standard deviation which we are getting from the previous studies or the pilot studies. Q is equal to 1 minus P and E is the acceptable sample error. So the formula n is equal to z square p q divided by e square and that is Coran's formula. So today we have discussed two formulas for finding the sample size. One is if the population is known and another one is a standard formula. Hope it was clear for you. Thank you.